what is the most important motorcycle skill that you should practice and master. Hey everybody, welcome to Booster Jeans Rider. This is Rich. And I'm Kate. And today we're going to talk about the most important skill you should learn while riding your motorcycle. Yeah, and that skill is normally the least practice skill based on the people that we talk to. And right. we've done it before we decided to make this video to find out what people were practicing. So, what is it? Is it the U-turn? No. Uh, what about the sharp right left turns? Nah. What about figure eights? Nope. <laughs> I want to tell everybody, one of the reasons we really wanted to do this video because we was on Sunday Night Fireside chat with the boys and one of the questions came up was what is the most difficult skill that to learn? And we truly believe it's a U-turn. The U-turn? But that's not the most important. No. So we're going to tell you the most important and tell you why we believe this. So what we want you to do, if you agree, just put in the comment section, say yes, we agree, that's the most important. Or you can elaborate a little bit more. We always respond to comments. Or if it's not the most important that you think, if you don't agree with us, let us know that also. Cause maybe we could change our way of thinking. And so what is the most important skill to learn and master? Is the braking and swerve and emergency braking. Yes, those two on the same level, emergency braking. Now, you're going to use those swerving and braking and swerving a lot more than you're going to use the emergency braking. And to be honest, let's, let's jump back on U-turns for a second. You can make a U-turn <laughs> by doing what? Walking your bike around. Exactly. You can, anybody can make a U-turn walk your bike. Now, don't get me wrong. Yes, you should be learning those slow riding skills and perfecting those slow riding skills because it gives you a lot of pride and confidence when you know you can do those sharp turns, sharp U-turns, and all those type of things. And they help you out in your daily, everyday riding. But let's face it. Like Cake said, you can walk a bike around during a U-turn. And? Or, or we can <laughs> go around the block. Uh, yeah, three rights and one left. That's a U-turn. <laughs> Going around a <the> block. <laughs> or shall we say, that's a change of direction. And you know, a right. lot of people focus on a U-turn because you're going to use that more than you're going to use emergency braking. And you would hope that you would use U-turns more than you use emergency braking. But emergency braking, by far none. And I don't think there's nobody that's going to change my mind, Kate. Okay? No. It's the most important that you can learn. I agree with you. It's the one that you hope and pray that you never, ever need to use. Because but if you have to use it, you definitely want it in your arsenal definitely want it in your arsenal and for us we practice it religiously now one of the things we've done prior to making this video we ask people we ask them hey do you practice your emergency braking or braking swerve and how many of them said yes not one person said yes not well, how many people you think we asked prior to making the video oh about eight people when we were at practice that time yeah we, we asked a lot of people and even though it's the most important, it seems that nobody practices it. And it's extremely, extremely easy to set up. Right and turn, right turn. Copy that. Coming over. Turning right. Turning right. And we, should, we, may, we just do a separate video on how to set it up. And it's pretty simple to set up. But well, what if they don't have cones? Uh, well, I can show them how to set it up without cones also. So maybe we'll do that video after this. I'm not sure. Turning right. So if you can practice nothing else, yes, go practice all your turns and get your slow riding and your friction zone now. But if you don't practice nothing else, because a lot of people say, I don't have time to do this, I don't have time to do that. Who wants to go out and practice on a nice, clear, sunny day? You want to go ride. Take five minutes. Practice your emergency braking. You could do that at least. 50, 60 times in five to 10 minutes. That's something that you do not- Why are you to stopping? Because the light just turned green. No, oh, the light was already green. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> 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 so go out there and practice that. This is extremely important to practice. And once you get it, you got muscle memory down. It's in your muscle memory. Yeah, you want to practice that because you don't want to panic 
right when it comes time to, to do an emergency break or a swerve you want to have that in that memory bank like rich said and you want to be able to practice that you don't want to grab your front brakes trying to stop your bike and you and you're panicking and you tip over you know practice that emergency braking you, you want to be able to stop that bike before you get to the object that's in your path or you want to be able to brake and swerve around that object that's mm -hmm. in your path but it has right. to take practice to do it right. and not panic with it so if you practice your emergency braking or you know feel free to tell us if you're not it doesn't matter look at those cones let's go ride those cones <laughs> <laughs> we see cones the words out my mouth <laughs> Anyway, I don't think of nothing else I can think of, but I think both and I equally, both Cake and I equally agree that this is the turn, left turn coming up. Left. This is the most important for any, any motorcycle skill that you should be practicing. All your braking, that emergency braking, braking swerve, braking escape, obstacle avoidance, whatever you choose to call it. Right. And you're going to use the, the swerving more than anything, more than U-turns, more than anything else, but you know, like you riding down the street, you see a, a pothole, you're going to swerve around that pothole. And you that's see? something that you want to practice yeah, with, too. That way, like I said before, when situation come up, yes. you'll have it. You'll be nice, relaxed, and calm. Exactly. <laughs> so we're going to lock this one down right here and cancel this video and close it out. All you right. have anything else to add, baby? No, that's it. So if you're out riding, Remember, ride long, ride hard, ride strong, but most importantly, ride safe. From Boots and Jeans Riders, I'm Rich. And I'm Cake. I'm going that parking lot and practice those breaking, <laughs> emergency breaking. Yeah. And we out. Peace. What did I just hit? Look at that bike. I see it. <laughs>